Investigations delved into improper or unlawful conduct by officials or employees of the municipalities, anyone else related to procurement processes of certain tenders, maladministration and contraventions of municipal prescripts at the Etiquini Metropolitan Municipality in KwaZulu-Natal, Tambo District Municipality in the Eastern Cape and the Naka Modiri Molemo Municipality in the Northwest and irregular procurement and inflation of prices of contracts. Based on the investigation, we found irregularity in the tender process, which was followed, whereby they, they were, we also found a corruption where one official received money from the service provider and they also bought a car for one official. And yet, each and every invoice that comes back from whatever services that Lazola Media would do, they will then, before they submit to the municipality, they will add a 10% management fee. Uh, on top of the fees that they're supposed to be getting, but on each and every invoice, they will add 10%, including the boxing that happened even before. Now, we do have names of the people who were giving instructions, but we did not want to divulge names of those people because they have not even appeared in court because we've referred matters against them to the to, to, um, to the to the NPA. In the Naka Modiri Molemo matter, no action was taken against the CFO until his term expired, while the municipal manager had no action taken against him until his term expired and he has since been reappointed as the municipal manager of the same municipality. The committee has committed to assist. This is helpful because these are specific instances, but I think it gives the committee a sense of what to even ask, a, you know, the, the AG to kind of specifically look at ahead of, their, ahead of their, their presentation, just in general terms, in terms of some of the patterns that we see, because it's going to inform our oversight work uh, as, we, as we go into the next oversight week and, 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 and in future. So the SIU says it will continue to work with the presidency to ensure recommendations are implemented. It says they are trying to put a mechanism in place to track all the recommendations. Abra Barbia, SABC News, Parliament.